What's going on, Silver Stackers? It's the Silver Killer here. here. Wanting to bring you a video on... That's right. Fractional Silver. Some love it. Some hate it. Where do you stand? Today I'm going to be bringing you several different offerings of Fractional Silver. Some things I really like. And, um, you know, just kind of talk about it a little bit. Create a discussion. Many do not see the need for fractional silver. When silver's at $20 an ounce, why would you need fractional silver? Everybody can afford an ounce of silver right now. Yeah, you're right. But I believe there will come a day where not everybody will be able to afford an ounce of silver. And I believe that day is quickly approaching. You know, August 15th, the price fixing you know, the manipulation is supposed to be done overseas in Europe on, on some of this stuff. Will that create a snowball? Will that event alone cause silver to, to hike up? You know, who knows? But I do know that it makes me feel better to have some offerings other than one ounce and higher. So right now, let's start talking about some of the different offerings that are out there. You got your one gram little little bars. They're very thin. Um, you know, they come in these little plastic cases. They got them where they're uncut sheets and they got them cut like this. I like the cut ones. That's the reason why I'm buying grams is because I want them separated. I don't want them as a sheet. Um, you can get anything on these little little guys right here. I've got Skull and Crossbones, Abe Lincolns, some more Abes. There's some Bunny Rabbits. Guys, you can get dinosaurs, fish, you know, whatever. ABCs. Um, you know, it's a way to maybe give a gift to a younger person, a nephew, niece, or, a, you know, your kids or something like that and start the conversation with them about silver. So, really cool offering. There are some fake stuff that looks very similar to this out there. Um, I have tested this stuff, this is real. I know the, who I got this from, it is real. So, just be careful about who you buy silver from, always guys, be very careful. Um, we've got a half ounce Yellowfin Tuna from Tokelau, $2 face value, beautiful coin. Moving right along, Mercury Dimes. I love Mercury Dimes. I love Roosevelt Dimes up till, you know, 64. Keep stacking them, guys. They're getting harder and harder to find. Um, so it's a great, a great coin to collect. You've got your NQ Cindian, one-tenth round. Um, Little coins here by, I believe it's Golden State. Yep, Golden State Mint. Beautiful. They did a great job on replicating the, uh, you know, the, the gold, $5 gold piece that looks like this. Beautiful, beautiful job. This is a quarter ounce. Um, I really like these guys. I want to get some more of these. Really like them. Okay, American Silver Eagles. One tenth ounce offerings. These that we're looking at right now is from Westminster Mint. Beautiful sculpt on the front, looks identical to the real thing, and the reverse also looks incredible with a mirror finish on that reverse. This is a beautiful coin. Probably the best looking one tenth ounce coin that I have. I love these. Now, Golden State also put out their offering of this. And the sculpts are great. Um, the reverse I do not like as good as the Westminster Mint version. It just doesn't pop. The reading around the side just seems to be a little bit more rough. Whereas this stuff right here, guys, this is smooth as silk. I mean, it, it's just a different level. I mean, that is readed, but it's super fine like a dime. You can just tell it costs more to do this. This right here, you know, look at that. You can see that clear as day. So, 
this is good looking stuff, but just doesn't touch the Westminster Mint. Moving right along, Pamp. They're doing stuff. Half ounce. I mean, excuse me, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, 10 gram. There's the Standing Statue of Liberty, which they're all standing. I don't know why I said that. And then you've got the Lunar uh, Series, which is the horse. These are super beautiful, and you do pay a super premium on these. This is the Cadillac of Fractional. Most fractional silver, you can get it for about $1.22 a gram right now. I know it's high, super high, but something like this, it's, it's on up there almost close to $2 a gram. So, fractional, baby, fractional. All right, you got a Scottsdale silver bar, five gram. I really, really like those. The reverse on that, boom, very nice. Valcambi, right off the combi bar, one gram, fine silver. Very, very nice, says that on every bar, one gram, fine silver. I like that. Let's see here, silver bullet, silver shield. You guys know how much I love silver bullet, silver shield. This is the 10th ounce, Freedom Girl. Simply, simply beautiful. I'm trying to get in close, guys. And there's the reverse. Tenth ounce. Let's see, look at that. Oh, I love it. I love it. Reading, very thick. Um, a little bit different than Argospirides. Argospirides. Argospides. However you say it. This is also a beautiful little coin. The reverse is just like the Jesus shekel. That symbol on the back. But it does say 10th ounce fine silver 2014. The reading is different. It's better. It's actually a little bit nicer than the Freedom Girl. But I like the Freedom Girls better in this one tenth offering. Okay. We've got the um, Peace Dollars here. Half, half dollar Peace Dollar. I know this is something from some kind of a Golden State Mint or something like that. But these are nice. Very beautiful. Half troy ounce. Okay, I'm gonna skip that. Go to the cannabis rounds. This is, it looks like the very front of the silver bullet, silver shield coins. I mean, the detail, it's almost like they stole the sculpt or the, the die. <laughs> um, it looks identical. Now, the back does not. One gram, 999 pure silver. I really like these, but I believe somebody stole the die. That's all I'm going to say about that. Up next, something I've really been getting into lately is Bullion Bank, a.k.a. Griffin. Guys, these guys are awesome. I talked to the guy, the owner, um, the designers. I, I've talked with them, and this stuff looks amazing. And it is high-quality silver in all kinds uh, of weights okay let's go through some of them I do not have all their offerings here but first of all we got some 10 grams stunning silver is money that's right SA Fondur okay um, Guys, I know it's shaky. This stuff's tiny, so I got to get in close. Uh, you got one tenth ounce over here. You got one fourth ounce, and this is the reverse. This is the reverse of that. And you've got, what does that say? Five grams. Five grams right here. Beautiful, beautiful. They also make it in one twentieth grant, one twentieth ounce, and one gram. Tiny little fellas. Tiny. But they also make this stuff in ounces. They do have ounce bars and they are making some coins that are stunning. I've got some on the way. When each one of these are mailed and, and shipped in, each one of them are individually wrapped. Just like that. Very, very nice. 
Um, so guys, check out Bullion Bank, Griffin, uh, all over eBay. All over eBay. Yes, it's premium. And once people buy this stuff, they, um, they keep buying it. <laughs> and there's only one dude that's got it, and that's Bullion Bank. So, trust me guys, you buy some of this stuff, you're going to love it. I just like stacking these little jokers. I mean, no, it's not stacking, you know, 10 ounce bars or nothing, but dang, it's fun. It's awesome. You still hear the chink, chink. So, stack it up, guys. Last but not least, the little ones are always left behind. This, my friends, is smaller than a gram. That's right. And this is real silver, guys. This is five grains. Nine, nine, nine. Fine silver. It is real. Let me see here. American certified bullion. But <laughs> it's tiny. I'm going to use those when silver hits a thousand an ounce. That's when I'm cashing in on those jokers. Silver hits a thousand an ounce. I'm breaking that bag out. But until then, no sir, I'm going to hang on to them. I like them. I'll stack those jokers up for hours at a time. Just keep stacking them. Well guys, I hope you have enjoyed the video. I hope it's been informative and I and if you're a fractional silver stacker, you're not alone. You're not alone. There are others out here like you. You're not crazy. And I, I just kind of want to leave that with you. You know, guys, stacking silver is something that I see as, you know, everybody stacks silver for different reasons. Um, I've got several different reasons why I'm stacking. But it's one of those things that's a lot of fun. And, you know, you want to share it, but you can't show it to everybody. On YouTube, you can kind of showcase your stuff and remain anonymous, but, you know, you really do have to be careful about who you do show your silver stack to, which I have nothing but fractional silver. This is everything I have, so, you know, I don't have anything. If somebody wanted to come rob me, I'd give it to them. But be careful out there, guys, and uh, keep stacking. And, you know, we'll see what happens with this London price fix thing. But until then, guys, we'll see you next time right here on Silver Killer. Be blessed. Later, guys.